Olivia, what is this? Mom, Dad, it's not... I think... I think I'm pregnant. Look at me so stupid. Who did this to you? Nobody. I mean, my, my boyfriend. Look, it, it's not a big deal. Okay? What do you mean it's not a big deal? Do you have any idea how this is gonna affect us? What is everyone gonna think? You know Abigail, this is a small town. Our friends from church, our neighbors. Your dad can lose his job. I didn't even know you had a boyfriend. You're just a kid. Didn't you always want a grandchild? Yes, but not from a pregnant teenager. What's his name? I'm going to kill him. Dad, please stop. It's not his fault. You are not going to keep that thing. What? You're not ready for this. You're in a high school. Now who's gonna pay for it? We can't afford another child. Let's just think about this. She can go to my sister's place until she gives birth. And we can take the child for adoption. But what we will tell to everyone when they ask where she is? We'll think of something. Maybe we can say she's at the boarding school. No! I don't want to go. I want to stay here. And I don't want to give up the baby. I want to keep it. Abigail, you need to be rational here. No. I'm keeping it. You want to keep? Fine. You want to throw everything away to be a struggling teen mom? And get out. Gabe, wait. Get out now! I need to talk to you. Yeah, okay, just one minute. I'm almost finished with the game. Buster, it's important. Okay. What's up? What is it? It's a pregnancy test. For who? God, Buster, it's mine. I'm pregnant. No, it's not mine. What are you? Of course it is. I haven't been with anyone else. Look, I just got into my dream school and I'm leaving in just a couple of months. Okay, but what about the baby? What about me? Look, I don't know. Look, I don't even care. Just get an abortion. I don't want to. I want to keep it. You it's... have to. You just get... Bro, calm down. Let go of her. Don't tell me what to do. Listen, if my parents find out, they're going to kill me. Buster, I don't even know where to go for that. Look, just look it up. This is your problem, not my problem. I don't want an abortion. I want to keep it. It's my baby. Our baby. Our baby? You're kidding. This is your baby. I don't even want it. And just get out. Look, no, we never even think. Never even liked you anyway. Fine. Fine. Screw you then. I'll take care of our baby by myself. Dude, you're such an asshole. What do you want? I don't want your pity. Do you have a place to stay? No. My parents kicked me out and, uh, Buster is useless. You can come stay with me if you want. What? Won't, won't Buster be mad? I don't care. Plus, it's cold outside. No. No, I'll find somewhere else. No, your problem, Axel. Look, my parents helped me with my rent, so it's not a big deal. I'm not just gonna leave you here. You can stay with me until you figure everything out. I still feel bad. 
And what are you gonna do? Sleep on the streets. If you wanna pay me back someday, you can. But for now, just don't worry about it. Isn't uh, worrying bad for the baby? I don't even know why. I don't know anything about being pregnant. Okay, let's go then and we can figure it out together. One day we'll fly away. Just take my hand. Dreams are so much it felt weird to live with my ex boyfriend's best friend. So, this is a new place. Nothing. Nothing special? Yeah, it's, it's fine. I can take that? Yeah. But I had nowhere else to go. And Axel was so nice. Please, uh, sit make yourself comfortable. That's it. Thanks. He was so selfless. Buster was never like that. Soon a few days turned into a month and I started feeling like I actually lived there. Not like I was just some pregnant loser taking up his bed. We were spending a lot of time together. It was nice. Here you go. Oh God, thanks. Like the berries? Yeah. Oh, okay. Maybe it was all the pregnancy hormones, but I realized I had feelings for him. Yeah. Well, what are you doing here? Babe, I messed up. I should have been there for you and the baby. Our, our baby. But you, you said... What about the college? I'm still gonna go to college, but I wanna help you too as well. My, my family found out about the baby and they want me to step in. So if I step in, you know, I can, I can still go. Oh my God. Your parents are threatening to not pay for your tuition, is that it? That's why you're here. Screw you. Leave me and my baby alone. Look, I never wanted this. You're ruining my life! I think you better get out of here now. Wait, hold on. You do a thing now. This is seriously the best you can do. Some pregnant slut. My sloppy seconds, huh? Just chill out. I. No. Guys! Guys, stop! I need the police now. Now. Hi, we are Abigail's parents. May we come in? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Thank you. What are you doing here? We should have reached out sooner. I'm sorry about what happened. How we acted. We read it immediately. We didn't know where you were. It's been almost two years. I know we didn't handle things the right way. No, we miss you so much. <laughs> and we want to be in your life. I know. It's going to take time to turn back your trust. Please. Give us a chance to be better parents. We love you. Just please give us a chance. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll give you that chance. This is Daniel. Oh, looks so cute. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
Daniel. What you doing? What are you playing with? What are you wearing clean mappings with it? <laughs> I guess. It's so cute. Yes. So, what did you think? Definitely let us know in the comments. We do read all of them. We are releasing a new Secret Diaries video every week. So be sure to subscribe and ring that notification bell to be the first to see it.